Due to rampant inflation in Argentina, over 1,500 Bitcoin ATMs are being deployed. Next on your 4-Minute Crypto Daily News. Hello and welcome to 4-Minute Crypto. Now today's show is from a post by Thomas Dahunty at NewsBTC.com and is brought to you by the Texas Bitcoin Conference. Take a look at this great conference coming to Austin, Texas at TexasBitcoinConference.com. And before I start, I want to remind you to like, subscribe, and share. Now, the U.S.-based company Athena Bitcoin specializes in the development and operation of cryptocurrency ATMs, and they launched Argentina's first cryptocurrency ATM a month ago in Buenos Aires. Another U.S.-based company, Odyssey Group, aims to install 150 ATMs in Argentina by the end of the year, and said that 80% of those will be operational within the first few months of 2019. The move will be Odyssey Group's first for foray into Latin America, but Athenia Bitcoin already operates 12 ATMs in Colombia, as well as one in Mexico. Moving forward, the company intends to further develop its operations in Mexico and also expand operations to Chile and Brazil. A company spokesman said that ATMs only allow customers to conduct Bitcoin transactions at the moment, but will be modified in the future to permit transactions in other coins like Litecoin, Ethereum, and Bitcoin Cash. Argentina is an ideal location for Bitcoin ATMs because inflation of its national currency, which has lost more than 50% of its value against the dollar so far in 2018. Charlie Bilillo, the director of research at the Pension Partners Investment Advisory Group, recently published findings on the return of cryptocurrencies and fiat currencies, which revealed that this year Bitcoin has actually outperformed the Argentina peso, as well as a Venezuelan boulevard and a Sudanese pound. Athenia Bitcoin's Argentina operations manager Dante Galizia said that the cryptocurrency ATMs in the world are growing exponentially. In Argentina, there's no commercial ATMs and the idea was to be the first to capture the market. The spike of the number of Bitcoin ATMs is not just limited to the southern hemisphere, as Bitcoin ATMs are increasingly being seen in many major cities across the U.S. It is estimated that there are 80 Bitcoin ATMs currently operating in Detroit, Michigan alone, and more than 2,000 others spread across the rest of the U.S. As Athenia and Odyssey ATMs introduce cryptocurrency to more and more consumers across the globe, authorities will likely attempt to push back by claiming the coins and ATMs can be used to launder money and conceal ill-gotten funds. But Joe Ciclio, founder of Digital Currency Consultants, BitAML, claimed that the association between money laundering and Bitcoin ATMs is an overrated and irrelevant concern. He notes that ATMs enable operators to obtain customer information like a driver's license or state ID numbers. ATMs can also enforce transaction controls such as daily limits per person and caps on transaction denominations. Have you seen a Bitcoin ATM in your area or your city? I know I have. Let me know your thoughts or where you saw one at on Twitter, where I'm at Gary Leland. And don't forget to join me every weekday for a new episode of 4-Minute Crypto. This is a CryptoCousins.com production.